So, go. These six horrifying shark encounters will surely keep you out of the ocean for the rest of your life. Number six. This clip starts off rather intensely as these unlucky cage divers suddenly get attacked by a great white shark. God damn! God damn! That's hella close! Oh my god, and I feel like a shark, if they wanted to, Granted, they might get hurt too, but like I feel like they can, they can break that shit. Cause that's close as shit. <laughs> oh, no, hell no. <laughs> They all continue screaming at the top of their lungs as the vicious predator keeps trying to get to the meal inside. Ah, uh, okay, I saw it too. That says scream, but then you go back a couple's laughter. Who the hell is laughing right now? Nobody should be laughing right now. Jesus. Look. At how close they are. I forgot the name of this channel, but somebody wanted me, a couple of people wanted me to react to this channel, and thank you. It's, it's good so far, great so far. But damn! Look at that shit! Oh my god! Either that shark is extremely hungry, or it's greedy. Or a, a number of things could be going on with that shark. The nightmare goes on for many more minutes until the animal finally decides to leave them alone and swim away completely. Jesus. Number five. On a nice day in Australia, a man's average kayak fishing trip quickly went south when he ended up being relentlessly chased by a... Did, to me, this shit, let me go back a couple scenes. That shit right here is the one of the most scariest things I could... I've never seen that shit in person, but I know what that means. That's cluckness right there. If I ever see that shit in person. You in the ocean. You in day trade territory now. It's rats. You see that? It's rats. It's by a hungry great white shark. At first, he begins recording after unfortunately spotting a shark fin poking out of the water just a few feet behind him. Hey, Dad, come here, please. It's chasing me. It's chasing me. It's chasing me. With the hungry predator still pursuing him, he eventually gets back with his friend and does his best to scare it off. Oh, Wouldn't that draw it more? She's very interested in me. Holy God damn. Five. For the next few minutes, both men. That weak ass. I don't know what that's called. That looks like a clucking toy. That shark looks like it's big enough to rip that shit to pieces try to stay together and do their best to keep an eye out for the shark just in case oh god damn why are you laughing 
As the animal appears to have, thankfully, lost interest, the men simply decide to stop recording and go on with their day. Number four. Near the coast of Mozambique, a group of divers had their day take a horrifying turn as they were unexpectedly circled by a rather curious great white shark. Initially, they appear to be peacefully enjoying the ocean floor when they suddenly spot something to their left. If I ever, how would they be speaking? If I ever find myself in this situation, I'ma just, I'ma just face facts. That's all you, and just, and just prepare for the worst, cause that's all you, ever, that's all you can do. You moving, you, you trying to haul ass in the ocean? Trying to haul ass away from a shark. It's like. It's like you. In a Supra. Toyota Supra. Trying to chase a snail. divers keep nervously recording the predator as it continues to swim around them, seemingly plotting something. I bet you all them other like small fishes are thinking like, I would hate to be y'all right now. the shark still suspiciously lurking nearby, they all unfortunately decide to stop recording, and what happens next remains unknown. They got Number caught. three. While offshore kayak fishing, this man felt rather optimistic after noticing something pulling on his fishing line. <sighs> <sighs> Although quite heavy, he still tries his best to pull up the unknown object, but what rises to the top is not what he expected. Ow! God! Jesus. Now in utter shock, he desperately rolls back his line and proceeds to turn off his camera altogether. God. Number two. Near St. George Island, YouTuber Grayship went out on an exciting spearfishing trip when he unfortunately became the unlucky target of a hungry great white shark. Before anything, he spends his time swimming around the bottom of the ocean and even manages to successfully catch a few fish. After a while, though, he feels like he's done enough and decides to swim back up to his boat when he suddenly feels something swimming beneath him. He feels that shit? It's rats. Now fearing for his safety, he immediately reloads his spear gun and does his best to stay alert of his surroundings when the predator unfortunately decides to come back. Understanding the danger of the situation, his friends quickly help him get back on the boat, and they all attempt to process what just happened. Number one. While kayak surfing in Florida, this innocent man's day took a horrifying turn when he was unexpectedly attacked by an aggressive shark. Originally, he can be seen simply paddling around trying to find the next wave to catch when the unimaginable happens. God damn. God damn. Hold on. 
trying to process the situation. After that shit, I'm immediately haul at. Haul ass and back to seashore. Seashore? Is that how you say it? Seashore? Yeah. And he carefully observes his paddle to find out what that could have been when the predator strikes again. God damn. You better. What you talking now, about? Full of adrenaline, the man immediately begins paddling away as fast as he possibly can and eventually makes it back to safety. Thanks for watching until the end. Oh, Check out course. this other video that is sure to give you the chills. I'll see you there. That was my first time reacting to his videos. <clears throat> oh, now I got the goddamn hiccups. Um, thank you all for the recommendation. I will, if I don't get on copyright claim or anything like that, I'll be sure to um, react to more of his videos. But if there's a very specific video that you all, you all want me to react from... Uh, his channel, let me know that in the comment section below. But, Claus, you did a great job. I love your voice. I love the compilation um, that you had in this video. Um, and I, did, I, like the, I like the quality. I like everything about your video. Um, and if there's if your videos are anything like this, then I'm sure I'm going to have a good time reacting to your videos. But I like the ocean, but I'm, I'm not about to... You know, just go out in the middle of the ocean. First of all, because I'm scared shitless of the ocean. Because I don't really know what's in there. Right? I don't know everything that's in there. Um, second. I mean, I can swim. But then. You messing with their territory. It would be different. If. You were trying to go up against a, a shark. Or trying to trying to run away from a shark and they on dry land. Because I feel like you can just outrun a shark or really outrun almost any sea creature on land. You know, because that's, that's our territory. That's, we not, you know. But yeah, but you trying to outrun a shark is like a snail trying to outrun a car. Like, you're not going nowhere. Like, bring out that, like, you're not, like, yeah. But great video, Mr. I was about to say, um, Mr. Claus. Let me just call you Mr. Claus. Keep it cool, keep it classy, and I love you. Stay happy, my family.